Hey Scorps, it's me, Shawnee. Welcome to Scorpio Inc. Du, 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 du. <laughs> yep, I'm back. It's me. And yeah, that was pretty obvious too. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. What a day. Right, I'm going to do a quick you versus them for the day. And I just want to say a big thank you to Vanessa for getting a personal read. I'll be getting that to you ASAP. Oh my gosh, this is going to annoy me hide it under there um and yeah my fourth grandson will be born today today so excited even though i can't see him i won't be able to see him for i don't know i don't know a long time we're in different cities but yeah i just wanted to share that with you guys i'm so excited ah, my eldest daughter is having her first baby um, okay, I'm going to cleanse our space and then we're going to get into it. This will be your you versus them for the 29th of the 12th of 21. But in saying that, that's when I'm doing it. If you see this reading and it's meant to, if it, oh, fucking hell, I'm really, really struggling right now. It's just like, um, when you see this reading, you're meant to see it, okay? If you've, if you've come across me, it's because you've meant to see it. Jeez, I'm going to struggle, I think. Okay, here we go. I'm really sorry, guys, if you can hear the traffic. Um, ugh, it's one of those things. Let's get into it, guys. You versus them. First of all, I'll be pulling the overall energy for both parties. Your person can be a romantic interest. Your person can also be a friend or a family member. Uh, if there are a lot of love cards, then, yeah, it will definitely be a love reading. <laughs> Just saying. But in saying that, just remember that this is general and uh, it may not resonate with you. Um, wh why? Why? Oh my god. Alright. Scorpio Collective. Overall energy for Scorpio and their person. Hey Sparkles. Wow. Okay. So we've got two cards for the overall energy. And funnily enough, Spirit just said to me, it's okay. This is your person. This is you. Five of cups for your person of the for the overall energy. Your person's feeling uh, like they're They've missed out on an opportunity. They've, they've missed out. Um, <laughs> they're naked. They're vulnerable. Um, <laughs> they're naked. <laughs> they're vulnerable. They're crying over things that, that have like missed opportunities. They may have had three chances with you, if this is romantic. Um, they may have three had three opportunities for something that's upset them but little do they know if they look up and turn around there's still two cups there so that means that there's still you know the option now you scorps you're in the queen of swords energy this is the no shit queen she knows her business she is very analytical in her thinking she doesn't mince words she's very vocal and um she will cut people out like real easy that kind of fits for us Scorp because it's real easy for us to do that right okay let's get into it Ooh, your person's feelings seven of wands your feelings The Six of Swords. Your person's next move. 
Three of Cups, your next move. The Five of Pentacles. Their desire. The Knight of Cups. Wow. And your desire. Ace of Pentacles. <laughs> this is like... Um, this is such a, this is an easy read, guys. This is an easy read. It's definitely like it's a, some some relationship, okay. Uh, five of Cups, for your person, they are, they're in like a defensive mode. They feel like they've been attacked um, in some way. Not, it doesn't necessarily mean physically, but they feel like, oh, far out. Um, I'm quite happy with the fact that I've gotten some attention, even though it's not the right attention. I don't know. Where the fuck did that come from? That's what I got. Intuitively. That's what that's what popped into my head and came out my mouth. Like your person... Your person feels like they've... They've had some kind of, they've had, they've had some kind of attack at them. Like, it could be fiery, fiery messages. It could be arguing, okay? It could be. Um, their next move is the Three of Cups. Their next move is that, like, this, the overall energy for them is the Five of Cups. So the Three of Cups in reverse is just like, oh my god, it could be third party situation. They could be dropping their uh, Playboy, Playgirl antics. Um, but this is also about um, releasing things that no longer serve them when it comes to some type of behavior or happiness. And I get that because it's next to the Seven of Wands. Um, I feel as though your person may have been far out. I feel like your person's done some shady shit um, and they want to change because their desire is to be the Knight of Cups. Their desire is to want to be able to come in and you know, express their emotions, express their feelings. And I know that when I did the the last um, You Versus Them, someone was coming in with apology. So the apology is the Page of Cups, okay? The next after that is the Knight of Cups. So maybe you've allowed them to come in with an apology, but it's because they feel like that. <laughs> okay, sorry. I have no pity for people who fuck around with Scorpios because Scorpios are so straight to the point and like, it's like, just tell us. I need to know where I stand. But when people are shady or people that don't um, communicate properly, it just creates so much carnage for us. It's bullshit. So, Queen of Swords overall for you, Scorps. And look at this. You're like, fuck that shit. I'm out of here. Six of Swords. You don't want to be in this mess. Um, you're feeling like, ah, uh, I'm out. I'm out. I'm done. Sayonara. Um, your next move <laughs> is the Five of Pentacles. You're walking away. This is such a strong message for you, Scorps. You're done. You would rather be out in the cold than stay in this, whatever it is for you. Whoever it is for you. Because your desire is a brand new start. Ace of Pentacles. This could be a new person. This could be just a new start anywhere. You might, might want to move out somewhere new. You might want to get a new job. You know, um, this is the practicality start. This is where you like, I know what's better for me, so I'm going to go for that. Okay? It's a new path. Wow. Okay. I'll stick with the same deck. Thank you. Okay. Let's get... Ooh. Bridging energy. Three cards. Wow. Whoa. Whoa. 
right egos being dropped heart heartaches being dropped and the truth will be told my god emperor in reverse three swords in reverse with the king of swords upright i just saw 10 10 look that up guys So I feel like the bridging energy for the, the pair of you, for you and your person, is that there's no ego. There, there can't be any ego, okay, in this situation anymore. You may not, you may have just been like, fuck, you are an egotistical, egotistical person with your seven wands. Um, the emperor in reverse, it just... It's like, I always get ego with the emperor, but but it is like a solid foundation. It's a it's, it's a, it's a foundational energy, but in the reverse, it's like shaky ground, okay? Uh, three of swords in reverse is like, oh, the heartbreak, it's it's done. I'm done with the heartbreak. Um, it's not worth it. It's not worth the heartbreak, okay? And the king of swords, queen of swords, remember 1111, Scorps. Remember that your overall energy is the King of Swords. Well, look at the potential outcome. It's the King of Swords. It's the next level up. This is the, I, I'm going to fuck you up card. <laughs> this is the, I warned you. This is like, okay, you're going to get it now. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was so funny. Okay, so I feel sorry for your person. Not. Um... It looks like they may have deserved, they may deserve this treatment from you. And by all means, Scorpio, if you're walking away from something toxic, just know that they are coming back because they feel like shit about it, whatever happened. Um, but you, you, you've got the opportunity to start something brand new. And you just need to be brutally honest, is what I'm hearing. Just be brutally honest. It's going to put this person in a bad place, but that's their that's their twelve twelve. They're going to put themselves like they're going to have to deal with it. And I think in our last two versus them, it was just let them deal with their shit. Let, let let them because it is totally up to you whether or not you accept an apology or you accept another love offer. Um, yeah, I like this for you guys. I like it. So I'm going to leave it here anyway. Thanks for joining me. Um, I will see you guys the next time I pop in. I, I, if I've got time, I might pop in tomorrow. Um, but yeah, I love you guys. Stay safe, stay blessed, and I'll see you next time. Bye.